and so Buzz, please, it's Christmas, bring me home. Okay, cut. That was very touching. Can you please email that to Buzz1151 at Comcast.net? Okay, I can do that. If Buzz is as dumb as I think he is, that message just might work. <laughs> Okay, Gnome, your information has led to the arrest of the IRS scammer and his gang. We have recovered hundreds of thousands of dollars. You got Buzz's money back? Yes. Oh, boy! Here's the 1700 in an envelope with your name on it. And another thing. Buzz called, and all charges have been dropped. You're free to go. I am? One more thing. There was a $3,000 reward on the capture of that scammer. Here it is. Wow! Three thousand bucks, and it's all mine. <laughs> Nom, the limo you ordered is here. But before you go, I want you to know: when you first came in here, I thought you were just another low-life crooked gnome. I was wrong. You, sir, are a true hero. Thanks, Captain. May the force be with you. The police force, that is. <laughs> Goodbye, everybody. Ta-ta. Oh, driver, please take me to Buzz 1151's house. Yes, sir. Oh, and by the way, stop at the Beavertown liquor store, okay? Yes, sir. This is the life. It's great to be a free gnome again. Whoever said money can't buy happiness never went to the liquor store. <laughs> Merry Christmas, everybody. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride. Well, here we are in part five of this uh, 1934 Westinghouse series. Uh, this episode is going to be a little bit short. Because I'm not in the mood to, to work on the radio. <laughs> what I thought I'd do here is I'm going to paint uh, the core of this transformer red. You know, everybody always paints it black. Why can't I paint it red? So I'm going to paint it red. Red is more durable. We're also going to uh, put that uh, copper ring into the speaker and test that see if it uh, eliminates any hum in there. It's supposed to eliminate hum when you got that copper ring on there. So we'll do a little test on that. And I'm gonna rebuild the electrolytic capacitor. And I think that should just about do it. So let me just uh, see what this looks like. We're gonna need paint. We're gonna need red paint. Looks pretty good. <laughs> So I hope you stick around, pull up a chair, have some leftover turkey, some leftover pumpkin pie for Christmas, and enjoy the video. I'll be back with the completed uh, paint job here and we'll see what it looks like. Okay, let's cut this and half. I'm going to give the people what they want. Sensation, horror, shock.
That's a hot one. See the wax coming out of it. Let's see if we can get it out of there. When you're hot, you're hot. This is the part of the cap that uh, is grounded against the can here. Some fun, hey eh, kid? Hey, congratulations! Well, here's the uh, paint job I did on the transformer. <laughs> Looks pretty good, doesn't it? Oh, brother. No, no, now turn it around. I think a nice red. Makes it look good. Also, here's my uh, capacitors here. There's three of them in there. Oh, brother. Not the prettiest job in the world, but uh, I guess what I have to do. This will go over like this. It fits perfect. What I want to do now is we're going to test the speaker, see if we can get the, the microphone to pick up any hum that it has, and uh, then we're going to compare it. We're going to put the brass ring in the uh, speaker and see if that eliminates any of the hum. Maybe it won't do anything, but let's try it. Well, I had a little paint left over in the cup, so I decided to put the uh, a coat of uh, that red paint on the buzz coil here. Kind of makes it look neat. Nice! For the speaker, remember that ratty old cable that came with the speaker before? Well, I bought uh, this uh, three wire cable here from uh, Radio Days, and, and it comes into this cloth covered uh, piece here, and then underneath that, there's three uh, wires, just enough for the uh, speaker here. I think that was kind of neat. Oh, that's neat. All right, let me hook this up, and we'll see if we can get any hum out of this thing. Okay, I'm gonna put the mic uh, next to the speaker, and uh, we'll see if we pick up any uh, any type of a hum on it. Let's put the volume all the way down. I can hear some hum, but uh, not bad at all. Let's see if I can get the mic right down into the cone here. Mm, feed me. Okay, we're going to put the uh, brass uh, shading ring in there. Let's just see if I can take this uh, screw out here without wrecking it. Be careful! That was a close one. <laughs> yeah! You see this bolt here? You just unscrew this. Mm -hmm. Okay. Here's the other shims that were on there. Remarkable. So here's the brass one. I'm not going to have any other shims except that in there. And that might be too tall. I don't know. Let's stick it on here. like that's gonna work so I did what I did before I turned the volume down let's get the mic right into the uh, cone here Feed me you would need three promotions to get to be an asshole You know, that thing did work because I hardly hear anything with my uh, with my naked ear. I'll have to play the video back to see if it picked up any of the hum like we had previously. All right, hope you enjoyed that little test. It's fun to experiment. 
Well, it seems the hum has a direct relationship uh, uh, to this uh, screw right here. The reason I wasn't getting any hum uh, on that last test there is because this was loose here. <laughs> well, what a dope you must think I am. And uh, I can barely hear some now. We'll put the mic up there. I can get sound out of it, but uh, if I really want to uh, get some good sound, that sounds really crummy, so I gotta tighten it. So there's that hum. So there's nothing I can do with that. And with the screw tightened down, it sounds pretty good. Down the sound. Holy mackerel, Andy. do it for this abbreviated edition of this 1934 Westinghouse. Hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you next time. Whistling in the dark I see the lights all over town And I keep walking up and down While I am whistling in the dark Whistling like a lark You know how to whistle, don't you, Steve? You just put your lips together and blow.